Okay, how are we doing out there today, YouTube? Uh, what we got here is a Deutz uh, 4FM 1011F. Um, customer called and said that they could not get it started. Uh, they said they were going along fine using their uh, JLG man lift. And then they saw a large white puff of smoke and it would not restart. So I was thinking maybe an injector or... Well, not an injector, but a nozzle maybe broke or something fairly simple. But um, what I ended up finding was push rod. Now how I came to that was um, I took the breather off because this thing was not making regular engine sounds. I mean, it was cranking over fine, um, but it just wasn't making normal sounds. So I took the air cleaner off which is attached to here. Um, put my hand about like this and uh, cranked it. And there wasn't any air being sucked in. Um, in fact, it was actually pushing out, which tells me that the intake valves were open during compression stroke. So that's not good. Um, so the next thing I did was pull the valve cover and I uh, watched the valves as I was cranking and they weren't moving um, and that's what led me to pulling that off which is really easy to take off um, and all this was caused by a uh, timing belt failure now being a diesel guy I'm not really too keen on these timing belts I don't see them very often um, most of the stuff I work on is all gear driven uh, you know a DT466 or a Cat C whatever, um, they're all timing gears. 